Well, it's that time of year when box turtles are on the move. You've probably come across one or two already and moved them to the other side of the road. Arkansas Game and Fish seeing so much interest in these turtles. They've put out some tips. Five News reporter Jose Carranza tells us what they are. There are around a dozen species of turtles native to Arkansas. According to Steve Dunlap at the Ozark Highland Nature Center, one of these species is really on the move. This is a three-toed box turtle. They're, they're moving off of more open areas such as grasslands and moving into woodlands. So that's why you're seeing more turtles, more turtle movement. Turtles crossing the roads, turtles crossing yards and, and, and that kind of thing. And that's a very typical thing that happens in the summertime. Arkansas Game and Fish are asking people to avoid contact with the turtles as they can pick up our diseases. If a turtle gets a cold, just like we would get a cold, it's very difficult for this guy to, to, to fight that cold off like we would. Dunlap says turtles also have a defense mechanism to protect them from humans. So when they get picked up and handled, they'll urinate all over you. In fact, one of the turtles activated their defense during our interview. And while Dunlap says you should avoid making contacts with the turtle, if they are in danger, he suggests that you should pick them up by the back of their shell and continue them on their path. And they're not going to like it too much, but, uh, but it's, it's far better for the turtle to, to get across the road than to, than to have to wait the traffic out. It's important to keep them going in the same direction, as pointing them in the other direction could be moving them away from home. They'll want to go back to that home range, and because of the energy that's exerted, it's, it's, it's going to stress them out. Another issue for turtles crossing the road, some have decided to paint turtles so they'd be more visible to drivers. Well, it's a really bad idea because a lot of paints have, have toxins in them um, and, and other chemicals that, that, that's really not good for them. The experts we spoke to today also say this can make them more vulnerable to predators. Covering news where you live, Jose Carranza, 5 News. Dunlap says that Turtle's home is typically around the size of half a football field. He says the best thing to do is to leave them alone and enjoy a glimpse of Arkansas nature. By the